It's the Truman Show mixed with Grand Theft Auto without the ability to back over people with a forklift. It's The Sims 3. Mm -hmm. As I'm recording this, it's the 10th anniversary of messing with these little people's lives. Causing them pain, anguish, and occasionally happiness. It's like SimCity with little human beings. Or the video game version of the old school board game of life. <laughs> Except without those cool little plastic cars. You can go way off the board in this game. You don't have to play the same game each time. The Sims 3 is a well-made, high-quality game, the kind of game that you would expect from the developers of this series. You start off by creating a character and then giving them a lifetime goal. I named my character Transar, and his lifetime goal is to have a successful career, lots of money, and a happy life. So I started off by trying to get him a girlfriend, while also succeeding at work and keeping a clean house. The problem with playing like that is that it starts to feel like real life. As work was going well, Transar met a nice young lady at the gym named Bebe. <laughs> I love their gibberish in this game. Anyway, Transar is a computer geek and she's into reading and gardening. <laughs> <laughs> so he spent many a date going to the library and taking her out to dinner, while also keeping up with the bills and household cleaning. He had a nice job in the science industry and spent some of the earnings on his home, buying things like a bookcase, hardwood floors, and a stereo. Time to invite Bebe over and throw a party. You can do these things in The Sims 3. Now this part's great. Note that the pizza and the girl show up at the exact same time. That never happens in real life. Transar has a nice evening, talks, dances. As the player, you choose what your character says. Whether they're male or female, they can be kind or downright obnoxious. You'll frequently note on the bottom right of the screen your character's status. They get hungry, they get tired, they get upset. This game is about balance. It's about playing like you're playing real life. This time with fake people, having real life problems and crises. All of the real world problems that one has to deal with managing a house, job, and love life are in this game. That's the whole point of The Sims. But it doesn't have to be. The Sims 3 is incredibly rich and detailed. You don't have to clean the kitchen. You don't have to compromise and try to have a polite date or a socially acceptable party. You don't have to go to the gym and try to stay healthy and good looking. I want to play this game like Scarface. I took Transar out like the fake trash from the non-existent kitchen and created Dr. Eight Ball. When you create your Sims, not only do you create their appearance, but also their personality. Dr. Eight Ball is an evil, genius, hot headed, kleptomaniac, mean spirited son of a bitch out to destroy the world. His ultimate goal is to become the emperor of evil, and he likes hot dogs. I designed his house and installed a secret dungeon. Rather than starting a traditional career path, Dr. Eightball joins a criminal organization. He likes to pick random fights with other characters and barge into other people's homes and use their bathroom. He sleeps in the graveyard, flirts with ghosts, and kicks over trash cans. Dr. Eightball is awesome. You see, this is the fun part about The Sims, because you can spend a lot of time playing this game. Exploring the environment, meeting new people, and trying to destroy their lives. I like all the different things that you can do, like changing the radio stations on your stereo, there's some good music in the game, and you can even have your characters sit there and just play video games. I feel like living one responsible life is enough. I'll recommend The Sims 3 to anyone who wants a good challenge trying to make their characters happier by making other characters sad. Now that's fun. And even though my new character Dr. Eightball is pure evil, that doesn't mean that he needs to be lonely. Oh no, far from it. 
Dr. 8-Ball enjoys everything that this game has to offer. Enjoy watching some more gameplay in The Sims 3. Still wanna play? The homegirl barbecue and gotta give me a plate. Even when it rains, swear to God. 